Hey everybody, Steve Maxwell here. Oh, here's something near and dear to my heart. This is my personal Rogers catalog from the 1967-68 catalog. It's the one I had since I was a kid back then. And I'm telling you, this stuff is incredible. This is my favorite catalog of all time. Full color pictures, beautifully done. Gorgeous picture right there. 12, 16, 20 with a chrome power tone. And here you got the Buddy Rich Celebrity 13, 16, 22 with a wood dyna. The Timbali Twin, which I never thought much of, but there it is. There's the Belson kit. Uh, and then the Citadel, 12, 14, 20. And then you had the uh, single lug mount, kind of like their version of a club date. The Roy Burns Starlighter kit. Cozy Cole Constellation. The Dave Clark 5 kit. And, of course, the Dynasonic snare drum. And I am a huge fan of Dynasonics, as you all know. I used to just look at these catalogs nonstop. I, I couldn't get enough of them when I was young. And this is one of my all-time favorites because the, the color pictures were so beautiful. And, of course, Louis Belson, one of my favorite players of all time and a big Rogers artist. But um, that catalog is well-worn, as you can see. But beautiful images and such great drums and great people behind the Rogers company. Ben Strauss, Joe Thompson, uh, incredible. Joe Thompson, the inventor, who came up with the Swivomatic uh, hardware and the, uh, the uh, bass drum foot pedal. Incredible stuff. Beautiful stands, very graceful looking. The drums sounded terrific. They were like the Rolls Royce of drums in the 60s. The chrome was incredible. The finishes were stunning. The uh, legs on the cymbal stands and snare stands were what we call swan leg, and they had a beautiful, graceful look to them. And everything was just incredible. The workmanship was superb, and the sound was unbelievable. Uh, in terms of of Rogers drums, it's an all-time favorite of mine, always has been, and the Dynasonic, as most of you know, is something I'm very, very fond of and have been a, a collector of for many, many years. So uh, I hope you all get a kick out of seeing this, and we will. We have a uh, Rogers video that I did, a uh, little podcast, a much, much uh, longer version than this. It's just two and a half minutes, so check my YouTube channel for that podcast, and uh, hope you enjoyed this, and we'll talk some more soon. Thanks.